around for a house to buy. You already know the price tag on both single and multifamily homes continues to rise in Rhode Island. And that's according to the Rhode Island Realtors Association. 12 News consumer reporter Sarah Grinelli has more. Sarah? Ken Mike, according to the Rhode Island Realtors Association, the price of a multifamily home with up to four units has gone up nearly 24% compared to this time last year. The price of buying a home in Rhode Island continues to climb. There, there's still so much demand, um, even though the rates are still higher, that they're, they're just driving it up over asking offers. We're continuing to see that. Chris Witten from the Rhode Island Realtors Association says the median price of a multifamily home has increased nearly 80% in the past four years, hitting a record high of $545,000 last month. You know, the multifamilies come on the market Typically, you know, a three, four unit or higher, you're going to get a lot of people because those are typically your investments. For those looking to buy a single family home, that price has gone up compared to last year. The median price comes in at $460,000 in May, which was the highest monthly price to date. He says people who are looking for a single family home sometimes wind up buying a condo. Historically, a more affordable option than a single family, than a multifamily. The median price for a condo dropped last month more than 10% compared to last year. He says for those looking, since summer kicked off, buyers have slowed down, so it might be a good time to start looking. You know, right now we only have a two month supply in Rhode Island of homes on the market as for inventory. And Witten says he expects home prices to continue to go up because of the lack of inventory. In the studio, Sarah Grinelli, 12 News.